everybody we're going to talk about honey today um there's a lot to know about honey um honey is very cool honey is an awesome food it's a perfect food it's actually a preservative honey lasts forever in fact they have found tibetan monks that were cremated um and it, even egyptian um that instead of being um mummified they were actually preserved in honey even with all their organs intact and when they pull them out they're the same as they were the day they were put in so um and that's one of the reasons why bee makes honey is not only for food but it preserves their hive it preserves their life everything honey is a lot of people consider liquid honey liquid honey is um so north um southern climate let's say you live not in the north um let's say you know kentucky tennessee florida all this other stuff that honey will never go solid because it doesn't face enough cold temperatures. So always be a liquid honey. Whereas honey that is in northern climates will start to crystallize and start to get solid. And the reason is, is because it's even more preservative. Now, some people like the honey to be a liquid state. So if it's in a solid state like this, you can put it in a double boiler. You can put it in some warm water, never in the microwave because microwave will kill it. And then if you do raise the temperature anything above, let's say 120 degrees, you kill it. Now it's not a raw honey. So anything below, uh, on, you know, basically warm water, um, you know, warm when you stick your finger, not burning your finger, then that will liquefy it. If you're going to put it in your tea or something like that, or just a spoonful, you don't even need to. There's no real benefit of liquefying it as over it being creamed. It doesn't really change the flavor. It doesn't change the profile. It's just preference. Um, but honey um, is, like I said, it's a perfect food. Um, it's uh, got a lot of sugar in it, a lot of carbohydrate in it, carbohydrates in it. But one of the other reasons why we want it in its raw state is because there are small portions of pollens and other things that people are allergic to. The bees infuse this and they infuse it with their immune system. So when people have said, hey, can honey get rid of my allergies? Yes, it can, especially your local allergies of the uh, the pollens, and especially most people are, they think it's ragweed that they're, no, it's mostly tree pollens. And bees, they pollinate everything. They pollinate the trees, they pollinate the grasses and everything like that. So they take a little bit of everything from your local area and they put their immune system into the honey, especially in its raw state. So it has to be kept in its raw state. So this is all about honey. Until next time, thanks, bye. Make sure to subscribe so you get more great videos on homesteading and health and turkeys and chickens and sheep and cows. So hit that like button and subscribe.